Hey guys, welcome to another video. So if you watch my previous video about ng Intel CPU piso net specs, yun. So this video is about AMD ng how to choose your piso net unit kung AMD naman. Previous video Intel. So this video ano naman AMD. So when it comes to AMD, sila talaga ang pinaka for me ha. They are the best when it comes to PisoNet or internet ano internet cafe kasi all in one na sila not all in one na computer but ang CPU the CPU CPU na siya at merong graphics card na so mara, malaking mas save mo compared sa Intel so i said before na kung Intel you have to at least 10,000 so kung AMD naman ang suggest ko is tantaranan Athlon 200GE sila talaga ang the best budget na CPU kasi nang malakas na siya and then meron sa malakas na graphics card niya and then around and I nag ano if you watch my previous video about the Athlon 200GE nang ano lang around 7 7000 pesos na meron ka ng CPU motherboard at RAM nang ang Athlon 200GE is perfect talaga for ano nang for piso net business kasi nandiyan na lahat. Konti lang gastos mo, good to go ka na. So, and also meron ako isang recommendation after ng ano. So, let's start with CPU. Athlon 20 GE ng ang RAM na ang dapat ang hanapin mo pinakamura na motherboard, usually BioStar 'yan. And then ang RAM mo, ang RAM mo, don't forget importante to is dalawang 4 gig na DDR4. Usually nang I made lots of videos na do not buy single stick na 8 gig I again I repeat wag kayo bumili ng naga advertise 8 gig DDR4 uh, 2666 megahertz do not buy that okay do not buy that always try to negotiate sa seller nyo kung pwede dalawang 4 gig okay dalawang 4 gig na DDR4 para 8 gig kasi ang Athlon 20 GE it performs well with dual channel memory the other one is for graphics and the other one is for system memory so that's why it needs two graphics once makadalawa kang graphics ng so ano yan ang fps ng games mo mag magically times two kasi if you're running gta 5 if you're playing gta 5 30 fps if you add another ram it will go mag 60 fps yan ang that is ang what i'm stressing about na if you're planning to buy athlon 20 ge nang go for double channel memory dalawang stick ng 4 gig kung marami kang pera go for ano ng 8 gig dalawang 8 gig pero since this a budget build kasi piso net business eh, you're trying to get mo, nang you're trying to spend at least the least amount of money para ang returns mo malaki so nang kung sa piso net like i mentioned sa previous video na ang minimum ngayon 2021 Ang minimum ngayon na RAM is 8 gig na, hindi na 4 gig or 2 gig. 4 gig na re required ng games. And also ng since built in ng graphics, ang graphics, no need tayo magasa ng graphics card. So wala tayong problema diyan. So you can you can spend that money to buy an SSD or malaking hard drive na space. So I suggest hard drive lang, 160 gig or 320 gig na storage. So and also Ang problema lang sa Athlon 20 GE, bawal sila, they can't run Windows 7. Something about sa drivers nila and then sa instruction set ng ano ng CPU that hindi sila compatible. I tried running an older version ng Windows 10, naghang siya, it keeps on freezing. Dapat updated na version sa Windows 10. So parang fino-force tayo ng Microsoft na to download the uh, the up to date version ng Windows 10. So, yan lang ang downside. So, pero when it comes to game compatibility, wala kang problema. Makaran ka Valorant, GTA 5 ng ano pa diyan, Grand Theft uh, San Andreas, ROS, LoL, Dota 2. Ano pa diyan ano mga games? Basta lahat ng mga games wala kang problema. So, yun ng Athlon 200 GE. So, meron din Athlon 3000 G, mas malakas pa sa Athlon 200 G. Compare nyo lang ang price eh. Kasi ang full uh, anti-friends nila is around three to 4,000 pesos. So, depende sa lugar nyo. 
ng ano okay din yan ang Atom 3000G same din double channel memory and also Ryzen 3 I wouldn't recommend Ryzen na gamitin nyo for PisoNet kasi it's so powerful na it's parang over ano na parang over gastos na pero depende sa iyo kung if you want to spend a lot of money ng para sa mga games kasi yung mga clients nyo or customers nyo gustong high-end games like Battlefield 5 PUBG ng Warzone or ano dyan so go ahead same din Ryzen 3 3100G with dual channel memory same din basta Ryzen Ath or Athlon or APU dual channel memory sila dalawang 4GB or dalawang 8GB so yun lang so ang CPU na ma-recommend ko is uh, Athlon 200GE Athlon 3000G or Ryzen 3 pero ang ano ko ang pinaka masuggest ko talaga sa inyo na if you want to really uh, ano ng parang future proof ng business mo if you're planning to put up 10 units I suggest Athlon 200GE kasi ang Athlon 200GE is very cheap nowadays and then ang motherboard niya sobrang cheap na and then ang RAM dalawang 4GB ng would cost around 2300 lang so ano, medyo, if you compare, kasi usually ang vendor magsabi, oh, get the 8 gig kasi 2,000 pesos ang sa. Pero if you do the math, ng 4 gig, dalawang 4 gig is 2,300 nang. So, medyo mahal sa by 300. Pero, ang performance that you are getting from the double na memory is times 2 na. Ang FPS mo will automatically times 2 or times 3, depende sa game. So, it's more makasave ka than gasto ka naman ulit another thousand thousands of peso so it's better to spend that extra 300 so by the way ang prices na mention ko dito yan sa Bacolod so guys uh, yan lang ng if you're planning to put up a piso net business with Athlon 200 GE I suggest dalawang 4 gig na RAM and 160 gig or 320 gig so mga timer mga ano dyan na we'll talk in a separate video pero ang specs is the topic of this video so may mga questions kayo just leave it down below i'll be happy to answer them and also kung mga suggestions kayo now feel free so guys thank you for watching and i'll see you on the next video peace